Nearly one week ago, Hurricane Irma made landfall in the Florida Keys, and since then, a lot of relief efforts have been going on with agencies out there in full force. News Channel 8's Paul Mueller has the story of another group that is helping tonight, and it is a story you'll see only on 8. More than 20 planes taking off from Tampa Executive Airport Saturday morning. On board, the basic necessities, things people need to survive. I get an amazing feeling by being able to help other people. Gary Cox is behind the controls of one of those planes heading to Key West, where last Sunday morning, Hurricane Irma, with its clearly defined eye, made a direct hit at Kujo Key. This could happen to you, and for a lot of people seeing this, it's happened to them. The Category 4 hurricane brought with it ferocious winds and heavy rains, flattened homes and businesses. And that's why Cox and 20 other pilots, all part of the organization Angel Flight, pilots who donate their time, plane, and fuel, are bringing these necessities to the people of the Keys. There are citizens. There are countrymen at Key West, and uh, we want to be able to help them in, in any way we can. Steve Perello is another pilot and grateful he could help out. And we're so appreciative that we could be part of this by having airplanes to help others. Neighborhoods here have no fuel, power, running water, or even shelters. And as other relief agencies like FEMA and the Red Cross work tirelessly to help the hurricane's victims, so too do these pilots. There's nothing better than giving and contributing and helping people, especially in the time of need. Now, Gary Cox is also using Facebook to help businesses in the Keys get connected with other Florida businesses and other companies throughout the United States. This way, they can help them get back on their feet. In the Tampa News Center, I'm Paul Mueller, News Channel 8.